Despite the riot at Little India two Sundays ago, it appears there hasn't been any dip in the number of Indian nationals wanting to travel to Singapore. Tour operators in India say outbound flights are running to capacity in the holiday season. Zain Awan reports from New Delhi. Kanchan Munga is busy shopping in a New Delhi market. With Christmas just on the corner, she has to send gifts to her sister Bhavna, who works in Singapore as an equity research analyst. It's Bhavna's first Christmas in Singapore and follows the riots that erupted in Little India earlier this month. The incident caused immediate concern for her family, but after assurances from her, they are now relieved it appears to be just a one-off incident. Everything is sorted out, so she's back to work. Life goes on after all. We would obviously pick a better and a safer place to work. And anyways, we've been hearing what happens now and then in Delhi, so Singapore is much more safe. So that's why we, we allowed her to go there and now that everything is settled there, so, so we're fine now. The worst outbreak of violence in four decades in Singapore's history was prompted by the death of a 32-year-old Indian man. Indians on home soil seem largely unaware of the incident or the decision taken by Singapore to deport some Indian perpetrators. But they have expressed confidence in the rule of law in Singapore. Now that the situation is relaxed, when we called her earlier, she told us that uh, Indians are not being randomly attacked. It was a spontaneous, uh, it was spon there, was, there were spontaneous re uh, riots. When similar incidents took place in Australia, there was outrage in India. Many locals were convinced racial discrimination was rampant there, but in the case of Singapore riot, most have been jumped to similar conclusions. It means there has been little impact on the number of tourists wanting to travel to Singapore even if a domestic downturn in the Indian economy is stopping some from heading abroad. I've been regularly checking with the airline because uh, you know that is the kind of business we are into and uh, when I checked uh, uh, all the flights are almost going about 80 to 90 percent occupancy that's a clear indicator I don't think uh, it has really affected. The Little India riots might have erupted a year before the Golden Jubilee celebrations of the India-Singapore diplomatic relationship, but they are unlikely to impact on India's cultural and commercial ties with Singapore. Zainavan, Channel News Asia, New Delhi.